Hi, my name is Arloa and welcome to Color Touch TV. Today I'm going to show you how to set up and use your Color Touch thermostat with a dual fuel system. <laughs> what is a dual fuel system? Well, it is an efficient way to heat your home by utilizing an electric heat pump during mild weather and then switching to a fossil fuel furnace when it gets really cold. This is a great way to heat your home when electricity is your primary energy source for heating. Here is a list of items you will need in order to use the dual fuel feature on the Color Touch. A Venstar Color Touch, a Venstar ACC TSEN air temperature sensor, and of course, a dual fuel heating system. Let's get started. Before we set up the thermostat, let me show you how to wire the back plate and install the outdoor sensor. First, you will want to connect the 24 volt power wire to the R terminal, then connect the 24 volt common wire to the C terminal, and then connect the wire from the fan to the G terminal. Next, we will put the wire for the first stage heat pump in the Y1 terminal. If you have a second stage heat pump, it will go in the Y2 terminal as shown here. W1 will be for the reversing valve wire, and W2 will be for your fossil fuel first stage heating. If you have second stage heating on your fossil fuel heating, it will go into the W3 aux terminal. Next, we need to wire a Venstar ACC TSEN sensor and place it under the eave of your house. Then place the outdoor sensor wires into these terminals here. Keep in mind there is no polarity for these wires. While this wiring color scheme is typical, your wiring color scheme may be different. Before attaching the color touch to the back plate, let's set the dip switches to their proper location. Switch the gas electric switch over to the right, and the other two remain in the position to the left. Next, put the color touch on the base plate. Now let's program the color touch. Before we program the dual fuel features, let's program the color touch to use the outdoor sensor. Hit menu. Scroll down. Select settings. Scroll down. Then installation settings. Scroll down until you see sensor settings. Now press wired sensor settings. Press use as outdoor sensor. Hit back. Then hit back. Scroll up until you find heat and cool stages. Notice the heat and cool stages button is grayed out. This is normal and not applicable to heat pump systems and will remain grayed out regardless of the programmed compressor and aux heat settings. First, let's set the compressor stages. Select the number of compressor stages for your heat pump. If you have a wire connected to Y2, then select the number 2. If you only have a wire connected to Y1, then select number 1. Then hit back. Now select aux heat settings. Select the number of stages for your fossil fuel heating. If you have a wire connected to W3 aux terminal, then select the number 2. If you only have a wire connected to W2, then select number 1. Hit back. Hit back. Select heat pump settings. Scroll down until you see dual fuel settings. Next, turn dual fuel on. Then turn change over with outdoor on. Then select your desired temperature for the heat pump before it switches to a fossil fuel heater. Press home and you're all done. That's it for today's episode. We'll see you next time on Color Touch TV.